So we do have more updates, guys. Altcoins are nowhere near a danger zone of euphoria now. This chart is a total market cap for all the crypto industry. And while we are not back at all time high, um, it's problematic that there is more, more news incoming. So problem is that a lot of charts of total two, three and others, there's a lot. Bitcoin is naturally strongest as it hits 61%. And obviously after the ETF listing, we've been seeing so much bad news hitting the crypto markets. Uh, now people are saying, you know, problem is we could be seeing like bigger drops in that sense. Uh, now the problem is that a lot of these institutions, because they got like, you know, they were buying here at 800 billion market cap, 600 billion almost, uh, they now are buying back at, you know, they want to, we want to get to 2.23 trillion, right? The issue here is a lot of these institutions who got it at 600 billion have now basically doubled their money, um, or, uh, like made a 120% gain. So they're easily taking profits and selling even more. And that's where I think the problem is right now. I think a lot of these big institutions, they're selling a very massive portion of their crypto. But I am still honestly very hopeful to see cryptocurrencies, you know, basically explode in the following few days um, for that reason. Because what we're seeing right now is like an opportunity for many investors to come in. Uh, there's like people saying that it's going to take two years for these drops to improve. And I think that's got a lot of people very, very worried in that sense. Like, I mean, I personally would be, I think it's a big problem in that sense. I think a lot of people are frustrated, especially what happened in the last few days with the markets. Like everybody was expecting a Bitcoin halving coming up, but so many institutions came in and took their profits, sold everything. And that's what I feel like that the problem should be. Like Grayscale now is dumping 600 million. So if you want to see a profitable day for Bitcoin, you got to put in at least, you know, a massive number, um, which would be potentially, I, I would say at least uh, 700, 800 million on top of everyone else selling. Like people have to realize how problematic this is in actuality. Um, this is a big problem for many in that sense. Like a, a lot of people ha were, were facing these issues in that sense. Um, they were seeing these big price drops. Personally, I'm not too worried in the long term sense, but in the short term, this is definitely very frustrating and I can definitely get it for a lot of people. So that's where really um, this market drop, you know, has proven itself. That being said, though, not the worst, not the best overall for a market. I was kind of expecting some sort of a drop, but not this type. Like I wasn't expecting that severe. And I think that's the big problem. Like a lot of people weren't expecting these markets to, to drop so much, to drop like 30, 20%. Obviously we're expecting some correction, but what do you guys personally think about this? I think it's still a very, very early time to say, um, but if you're expecting like the Bitcoin halving, I'm getting more and more kind of worried in a sense for the Bitcoin halving, in my opinion. Like, I think there's going to be more concerns in that in that aspect so that's one thing to be worried about but i will keep you guys updated with more news with more content if you guys want be sure to smash that like button and until next time peace everyone